This is CBBS on YouTube. Find even more fun and games for your child at the CBBS website. The following content is intended for our CBBS grown-ups audience. The world is made up of lots of different shapes. This is important to your child because it helps them make sense of the world around them. Shapes are everywhere. You're running around the circle. <laughs> Everyday games you can play are looking for shapes all around your house or garden. Where's the square? One, two. By doing this together, it will help your child to recognise two-dimensional and three-dimensional shapes. Why not watch the Num Tums to discover all sorts of interesting shapes? Try this. Now what's this? It's got six square faces with twelve strong edges, a cube, a cube of cheese. Lovely cheese, Fluffy. And if you go to the CBB's homepage and click on games, you will find the Tree Foot Hall Magic Builder Wall game. You and your child will have loads of fun working out which shape fits in which space. Yes. yes. To take things further, why don't you try building your own house together out of different shaped building blocks? Before you start, you can have a chat about the shapes you will need for the roof or for the walls. There's another rectangle. Whoa. Using 3D shapes will help to develop your child's problem-solving skills. Here are our top tips for introducing your child to shapes. Together, look for triangles, circles or squares around the house or garden. Watch the Num Tums to learn about interesting two- and three-dimensional shapes. Play the CBB's Chi Fu Tom Magic build a wall game, or build a house out of different shaped building blocks. By watching the Num Tums and playing fun, everyday games, help your child to use mathematical language and develop a confident understanding of maths. Which one do you want? Mm. That one. Why did you want that one? Because it's big. Bigger, smaller, heavier, lighter. You're probably using mathematical language without even realising it. So who do you think's got more marbles? Uh, me. Yes. In this Num Tums episode, your child will hear all sorts of mathematical words. This one, this one is longer than all of the other sticks, which means it's the longest. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Here are some top tips for using mathematical language. Watch the Num Tums to hear new mathematical words. Try filling two different size cups with marbles and ask which cup has more marbles and which cup is bigger. Use everyday mathematical words like bigger, smaller, longer, shorter, heavier or lighter. By playing fun, everyday games help your child to solve practical problems with maths. A teddy bear's picnic teaches children all sorts of wonderful and practical problem solving. This gives your child an opportunity to apply their different math skills. One, two. For example, how many cakes they would need to put out. This encourages counting. Or matching cups to saucers, which is one-to-one -one correspondence. Okay, the plates out for the teddies. Yes, one. From my experience working with young children, it is really important that we develop that love of maths because the skills that they learn today will be the skills that they need tomorrow and for the rest of their lives. Which one is bigger, which one is smaller? Smaller. It's only smaller, yeah. So by playing fun, everyday games with your child, you will help them to recognise two-dimensional and three-dimensional shapes, as this helps them to define the world around them. Use mathematical language and therefore develop a confident understanding of maths and solve practical problems by applying different math skills. Find out when we add new clips and build a playlist especially for your child by subscribing for free to the CBeebies YouTube channel.